Restoring a SQL database is quite easy task. We all aware uh, to restore a database, we need a backup of a particular database, and we can implement the restore. Okay, but when we got the situation like you know you need to restore a particular table, can be possible in a SQL because in Oracle we have a you know the approach to a schema level refresh. We can do a particular schema refresh from production to dev, but in SQL, normally we are doing the refresh from the production to development for an entire database, not a table actually. But when the situation came to like you know you need to do the refresh one particular table, so is that possible in a SQL? So in this session, I am going to discuss about all those things in details. Please be with me, and whoever new on my channel, please like to subscribe, and don't forget to others. So let me connect my management studio first. So this is my management studio, okay. So now the point is, can we do a restore a particular table in a SQL? Yes, we can. We have a approach called export import. We have a wizard called export import. Through that wizard, we can take a, we can export the production database table, and you we can implement on a you know development. But the situation is, uh, whenever you try to import, you may be encounter lot of you know validation issues and all. So that you need to fix it. But yes, we can do it. Do it. But normally, in a SQL, it's a very rare task. when we are getting this kind of issues this kind of uh, refresh normally we are doing you know uh, from production to development entire complete database so let's assume how to do the export import wizard actually so uh, from the database tech 02 if i am going to you know exporting the data of a particular table for that you need to go to particular database right click task and here you can see the export data so it will open the export import wizard okay just simply click on the next and here you need to come with uh, your native client whatever you, and here you need to select your database so i am just taking a particular table from tech 02 just assume example uh click on the next and here you need to give the destination as excel okay and it will ask to you know where you want to keep the save so i am keeping somewhere in my uh, local laptop okay click on a next it will ask you know copy the data one or more table or views or write a query a specific database transfer so i'm going with the first option click on a next and here you can give you can see the source and the destination so which table you want to take data you want to extract the data so i'm just going to create a particular table for the you know sales credit okay here when you execute the when you go to next level it may be encounter lot of validation issues and all from this edit mapping you can go and you can fix it from the here what are the in, uh, counters need to select so that you you have to uh, give the attention for those areas if you are getting the validation issues or else you need to click on a next okay so here if i can see uh, the two error i can simply get what as of now i am just ignoring this one okay if you can ignore it but as i said you need to figure out all those things before proceeding to you know import the data on a development so you need to fix it actually otherwise it will get you know the failure it will not import it successfully i'm just clicking next okay and then finished so it's a very small table i think there's no data at all so that the region i think just click on a close now i'm going to import this table to tech 05 okay if you go and import it here click on import with the same method and wizard will open now here you need to select the source so here source should be your excel because you extracted the data in excel right so now we are going to select the excel file from here and now target again the particular database which you want to 
so i am going to import on our tech05 okay here it will ask the both the you know uh, the both the tables click on a next and click on finish so this is quite looks like easier but it's not that much easier what i'm trying to say you may be encounter lot of validation issue here okay so that need to fix until unless you cannot fix that validation issues uh, you cannot assume the imported uh, you know all the data it will get failed here okay in my situation in my case there are nothing in the that table actually so that the region it's imported so quickly but you may be face lot of validation issues that you need to fix prior and then import it so the answer is the question was can we do a particular table refresh in a sql yes we can but with the help of export import wizard but you need to figure out lot of issues you you may be encounter lot of validation issues that you need to fi fix it sometimes only we are getting this kind of issues this kind of request if you uh, mostly we are getting the refresh for entire database not a particular table so hope you got my point the uh, what was the situation and how to deal that okay so very soon i will meet you in the next another session with sql quick learning okay till then bye bye thank you and take care